It feels so good, you know, that that from the from this case on, it feels so good to know that parents have always been fighting, you know, not only with this, mm -hmm. but to show that parents always wanted the best for their for their children. And as I go around the country, I meet so many professors, you know, and teachers and that are working so hard to try and change the system. It's very hard to change the system, what's going on in education. Well, you know what happened is that Mendes versus Westminster, what Mendes and Brown did, it allowed us to go to any school we wanted to. By law, they cannot keep us from going to any school. You can move to whatever area you want. Your parents, you know, if they can, move to that and then a very affluent area and go to that school. What it didn't do is, it didn't desegregate us at all in schools. We are more segregated now than we were in 1947. The two schools that are named after my parents are 99% Latinos. What does that tell you? It was desegregated, and you call that defecto, D-E-F-A-C-T-O. And what is what causes us to be so segregated again? And it's not by law. They can't keep us, you know, by law. But it's by so many other evils, you know, demographics, you know, where you live. Uh, parents not wanting to get out of that area. Parents not having the money to move out of the area to go to an affluent area where they can send their kids to to a white school because if you're in a fluent area, they can't keep you from moving there and they cannot keep you from going to that school. So the, the people that are there in those two areas are because, you know, a property mostly, you know, and because they like to be with their commodities and they don't want to move by now. I have a whole mess of family living in a barrio there in Westminster that they'll never move out of there no matter how much money they have. So sometimes, and what that does is that the kids, their kids end up in the in the segregated school, you know. And the evils are that they, the politics that they change the districts, you know, to mm -hmm. accommodate and put, like, the district yeah. here for all the minorities, and you know. So many evils, so we are, we are segregated right now. So Mendes and Brown did not really desegregate us, like, you know, by law they did, by, by de facto they didn't.